towards general harassment. In a game like this, you should be able to kind of mess with the invoker a bit and definitely secure the safe lane and get Batrider out of there. Both teams, with the, the Bounty Hunter roaming around, Newbie have that slight edge where they can continually poke and harass. This mid lane is going to be very Newbie favored. Death Prophet already beats Invoker in a 1v1 with a I Bounty Hunter present. Kaka, what are you doing? You're a madman! Look at this man! He does not care. Now Crit, with the reaction, Telekinesis on to move. Very far, it's not going to save you, son. First blood for Miracle as Newbie. Yeah. Getting excited, a Newbie off that play. I think they were a little bit too excited. They need to tone it down, keep their cool here. Already up top, Kaka is coming in, but Moon has got a sentry down. Kaka oh, coming in with Hal fight, Antoine. Fight. This man in a lot of trouble, still just level one on the bat rider. As Newbie will take a kill onto the bat, bringing it to 1 1 on the board. The kill going the way of Tron on his line. Rubik as well is available. And bottom lane as well, OG trying to do their best in terms of zoning out KP. Uh, he's struggling to find any kind of CS and just level two at the moment. Mid lane trying to go in onto Miracle. Kaka's revealed himself. The TP reactions there. Crit again. Telekinesis onto Moon. OG looking for a turnaround, but they've lost Miracle. Newbie will take the kill. Can Crit bring down this Death Prophet? He hasn't quite got the damage to do so. So this time, Newbie. Oh, yeah, that's very risky move from Newbie. It's Sunstrike attempt on bottom rune. Almost found Mu going for the rune. Miracle on respawn threw it down there, kind of expecting the death from the camp of the side. He's, he certainly had a bit of a tricky time up top. He's not finding much farm. He's getting a fair few levels. Bottom. Kaka coming in. Dropping down another ward flight. And he's not going to be able to catch it out for the time being. Just out of range of bottom lane. In fact, Newbie going to be the ones to make it go on to no tail. He's got the ward cry. Will it save him? Well, with Mr. Juan turning up on the line, it looks like they've got the lockdown. Can they save this man? OG, oh, they can't. No tail's gone. A newbie pick up a third, keep playing with it. As Invoke comes back up, he's invoked it. He's trying for it. Oh! So close. So damn close. Oh, that's oh. the second in a row he barely misses on Death Prophet. Oh. It fed from bottom, no tail. He did not expect this one. Has he got the backup? Has he got the friends? He's only got one. I don't think it's going to be enough. Can fly save this man? Doesn't look like he can. Will throw out a magic missile, but newbie again, killing no tail on the spare. Meanwhile, top moon's going aggressive. Let's see if he can get away with this one. There will be a reaction from the mid laner. Moo coming in on the Death Prophet. Juan turns around with the initial Hex. They've got the Siphon Slow. Can Moo finish this one off? Should have a swarm up again in a second. And he does. Comes out and he'll find the kill. Moo with a fantastic TP reaction. And this is just keeping himself just out of distance of the potential of being caught out by a crit telekinesis. Oh, I say that as he does indeed get caught out. The reactions will come through. A huge amount of lockdown from OG and they'll take the kill. KP, he was playing it safe for a long time, but the greed got the better of game. It kind of sets up and it, once you find yourself in a team fight, you can pick up a new spell after you've got two or three cracks off. Twine at oh, me. Look at oh, that no. stun. Absolutely perfect for Twine. You know, they should have the damage for this man, and they will a second death for Miracle, as you said, yet to die on the main. It comes up, you're looking at Ancient stack, so OG still remaining very efficient. Absolutely, OG certainly. Oh, let's one. see if they can find the lead in on Can they help this lion? They can't. OG will find it. Yeah, just the Invis rune, just being able to camp behind that tier 1 tower, and... OG will get their second tower in a row with this. I mean, look at that as well. I mean, the gold swing from that nine engine because they've got this track, as you said. It's a huge steal from Crit, and if they're able to find kills with this at the same time, they will lose the courier, Kaka. Gets the sniper. off. And they'll try and find him. Kaka thrown out the track, but there's your telekinesis just out as well. And again, it's going to be another track kill for OG. Back-to-back -back track kills for the team with a Rubik. ...of kills, but it would be nice to make sure this man can't throw out any more tracks. Oh, they found a bigger one, though. Miracle. And let's see if they can get it. He's been tracked. And they've trapped him in. It's going to be another kill onto Miracle. He Newbie. used the Sunstrike there. Just Hey, Newbie get more for that kill. Absolutely, yeah. Especially with the track as well. And now the push going to come in, and in fact, they might find a kill as well. Jumping immediately onto Fly. Moon will try with the reaction, but the two man silence from Moon will now lose Newbie to move in for more. Open wins onto Fly. They'll take down one Moon. He'll go for the lasso here, but Newbie, they're not going to be frightened of going in for more. They just take down the Batrider. They jump in immediately onto Crit, and they'll take down another here, Newbie. Double kill for Hal. Perfect aggression. And OG, they just don't have the heroes alive to. With their whole team, look for a fight.
OG themselves smoked up though. Oh, smoke on smoke here. It's going to be absolutely huge. It's just failed on KP Moon, but Moon reacts first. Jumps in with a hex for Twan. The counter play. Moon falling low. No, he's going to be kept alive. Finally goes down. How with the first kill of this fight? Can they find anything in return? They're trying to go onto how onto the life stealer. Moon's there to back it up. Going for the siphon onto no doubt. The Shuriken flies through. Newbie, they'll pick off a second. Eyes back towards the mid. They've lost another three heroes down. The finger from Tron. That's going to make it four. Newbie taking this team fight with absolute fashion. The stolen crush from Crit will allow him to buy himself some time. Oh, he gets Turns the finger. With the finger and he's actually managed to make the play. Taking down Mu. And Crit. I mean, he does the best to find what he can at the end of that one, but still, OG... When you don't exorcism, it gives your Aww. opponents time to react. Let's see what OG can do with that. They'll jump in immediately onto KB, but again, Chuan with his reactions. Hex on Tamu. He's got it on the high ground. They've got the subject down on Tamu. He'll use himself up. No doubt, trying to fight, but how? Takes him down. They've lost the spend. They'll grab Mu with the telekinesis. They brought down the Death Prophet one for one at the moment. Jumping in, KP cross of the fly. Manages to swap Miracle out, but Chuan again with the stuns. Controlling a second core of OG. Fly to fall as well. It's a double kill for Howe, only Crit and Moon left alive, Kaka, can they kill this? Crit with the stolen exorcism will find one kill again, but it's not gonna matter, Newbie, taking a triple for Howe. I mean, Crit, he is for this one, because it's going to be incredibly hard, they don't even have the fortification available, it's already been used. So, Newbie could get away with an incredibly easy reaction, unless OG have got an answer, and here we have it, Moon. Jumping in, bringing Howe back, KP immediately finding the two-man crush. The Aegis has been taken away from Howe, but at the same time, Newbie, they're just continuing to fight here, getting the tracks out, forcing Miracle back. No tail, drained of his mana there by Juan, and Howe just forcing the spam back to the base. The finger from Juan will finish off No tail, buys back immediately, but just look at Moo with a four-man silence of the Cyphers, forcing OG right back into the fountain as they create the space here around the Rex to allow Newbie to finish these off. Can OG keep them off there? Oh, no tell. And with the stun, so it's like there as well. The rage is out, but Hal turns on the armor and immediately jumps through No Tail. No Tail being forced back. Hal will turn his attention towards Fly. The Crypt Swarm will burn him off. Miracle goes down on the sidelines as well. No Tail with a storm hammer. He'll find one. Tries to go for the hits, but again, the stun control is too big for Newbie. The armor toggle will keep them alive. A miracle buyback. He needs to finish these guys off. He needs to sail across them. Hal turns to Crypt, takes down one. Now it's a miracle. One hit, two hit downs. A half healthy and both runs back to base, don't tell, with the stun, finds the kill, and OG. It's not a... It has been scanned out, OG know that there's some kind of movement from Newbie coming from across the river, Crit, he needs to get himself back, KP, how aggressive is he going to go, incredibly, jumps in, two man crush, Miracle's gone, Fly, will be forced to wait, but Miracle now down for 70, the Shuriken bounce, it will end up finishing off Fly, OG. Big for OG, if they can take a fight before the Roastery spawn and get away, we're coming out successfully, but again, it's been rumbled, Kaka starts to lay down the tracks, loads of soul bombs, so he can't really jump into this man, Moon still tries for some sort of initiation, but Newbie with the counter and the bat's gone, Boom, getting forced in. The mech's there, the sun strike. It's gonna be too early, out of time there. No Tail's trying to move in with the BKB, but at the same time, KP on the back with the crush. And look at this, the control from Trump finding the perfect angle, getting the stun. How with a triple kill, and GG is cool. Coming into this one, Gods, I think people thought this would be close, but this was not close at all. Everything on Newbie came together perfectly. I you could look at, and you could talk about any one of their players and just be like, they played perhaps one of the best games of the tournament for each individual player. Like, other than that first blood mishap, Newbie played a perfect game. This was just some very polished Dota coming out from the Chinese squad. OG, like, they thought they had a plan with the first stage pick and Boca, but it just felt too slow paced against the Newbie aggression. Absolutely. If the newbie to come out with a 